Today, we're going to be discussing the top 10 things you can do to pass your time while in quarantine. Come on, let's experience the ultimate pain together! <laughs> Guys, to start off the video, I just wanted to thank all of you for 100 subscribers already. I mean, I just started my account. I just had my first post yesterday. And uh, you guys have almost got that 300 views. So it's a pretty great way and a pretty great introduction to YouTube. But other than that, let's get right into the video. Number one, learn how to play guitar. All right, guys, for number one, I'm gonna be teaching you how to play guitar. Hmm. This one doesn't have any strings. Uh, that's not good. I don't know what we'll have to do about that. All right, guys, I got a one solution for all of this. <laughs> well, guys, it doesn't look like I'm gonna be teaching you how to play anytime soon. So uh, let's go on to the next one. All right, number two, play with your dogs or any pets that you have. Since we had a whole lot of hype around these babies, this is Macy, if you guys don't remember. She's a chocolate lab. She's, a, she's just a little baby. And that's Princess. They just woke up. It's morning time here, so they're just waking up. Guys, back up! Back up, guys. I don't want to get all up in the video. <laughs> yeah. But these are the little babies. You can play with your, play with your dogs, you know? Make them happy. Make them love you more. Yeah! All right, guys, on to the next one. All right, for number three, we're going to be doing something for our mental health. We're going to be writing down the names of our enemies. All right, guys, for this one, it's a mental health tip to help you guys get through the break. I know it's really rough and it's stressful knowing that, I mean, some of your parents are getting laid off. And I get that, that it's a whole, it's a whole time that it's struggle for everybody. It's not just for you. It's for everybody around you. So it's a good time to let out your mental pain or anything like that so i got this really nice notebook for like five dollars um and it's just it's just a really nice thing where you can write down the names of your enemies and you know write down why they're your enemies and like you know let out all your anger and just let them have it if you i mean if you know but like it, it's a really great way to help you guys just get through some struggles or anything that you're dealing with in the quarantine times. Just write it all down, keep a journal, keep of how your days are going, and maybe you can tell your kids about it one day. But other than that, um, here's the journal I use. It's a, it, it's a really nice notebook. I got it for like $5 online. I would highly recommend because it just makes all my enemies and, their, and my pain just go all away. <laughs> Well, on to the next one, guys. All right, for number four, guys, we're going to be making food and keeping us healthy. And this is going to be beneficial to everybody throughout this time of quarantine. All right, for this one, we're going to be cooking food. I've got a bunch of Tocito combination pizza rolls here. So what I do is I put it on the 400 setting on this air fryer, you know. And then, um, you know, I set up for online school. I got ranch sauce you know, to put it with my pizza rolls. You know, there's my, uh, here's my setup guys. And there's the dogs. But another thing that you can do is set yourself up for success by, you know, making food, eating, just relaxing and having a good day, making the day good. And, uh, you know, like we keep other things, you know, like pizzas and all that. You whatever you guys have at home just make something to eat try and keep it kind of healthy keep protein keep food but you guys got this we're gonna make it through quarantine all right on to the next one all right here we go number five something fun to do is to revisit nostalgia or revisit your past when you were a child all right guys since macy doesn't want to come down here i'm gonna show you all right, for number five, we're gonna be revisiting nostalgia. See guys, as a child I grew up, like I told you, 
I used to, I used to, uh, really like dinosaurs, and I still do. Look, there's my first Halloween costume, guys. Look, this was one of my first stuffed animals. <laughs> oh, boy. You know, like a helmet, you know? go-kart, or dirt biking. Look, holy crap, I don't think they make stuff like that anymore. That's so cool. It's a kite. Oh, boy. Look, like we got Stega, I mean, uh, Triceratops. And then we got Spinosaurus. And then we got Dilophosaur. If you guys don't know what those are, those are some of my favorite dinosaurs. And then, uh, like, just, just explore your past. Go through with it. Like, holy, oh my god. I remember when I got my first Kinect with an Xbox. Y'all remember that? Xbox 360 with Kinect. Oh, there's my yearbooks. Holy crap. I didn't even know those were in here before I started making this video. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm gonna have to go through those. Well, <laughs> I guess we'll go on to the next one because, uh, I'm gonna explore my yearbooks. Hey guys, I just wanted to stop and say that if you've made it this far through the video, that maybe you should consider subscribing or at least giving a thumbs up on the video and or turning on post notifications to see every time that I post. Uh, thanks guys. All right, for number six, we're gonna be playing with ourselves or by yourself. All right, for this one, you're gonna grab your balls out of your room and then you're gonna go downstairs and I mean, this gets kind of hard to do by yourself, but I mean, you just take your uh, soccer ball, put it in here, and like you try and like, like you try and see which one's easier to win, you know, like play foosball or something, you know. It, it gets really hard to play with the ball by yourself, you know, but like, I don't know. It's just how it is, guys, or like, you can come down to your like kind of sort of man cave like here let me turn on the light but we got like a tv down here and we got a uh, like workout stuff down here so uh just find a way to uh <laughs> make due time and just uh hang out and pass time and come with cool ideas for games or just Im don't invite your friends over because you might get sick or uh find your old guitar amp that you didn't even know was down here or Find some Chick-fil-A Polynesian sauce. Or, um, play with two balls at one time. You know? All right, guys. Uh, on to the next one. All right, guys. For number seven, we're going to be making our house smell better by lighting candles or just doing work around the house. All right, guys. This is probably the easiest one. You just take the lighter. And you hold it. Oh, this one isn't wanting to work. You hold it. You like that. And then we can go in here. Light this candle. Light these candles. Oh, those aren't candles. Um, Light this candle. Oh, somebody just drove past. Blaring some music. But yeah, guys. Lighting candles, you know. And then uh, turn on some TV, watch some TV, and then uh, maybe cut on your Roomba. Oh, if you have a Roomba. Oh my God, I think it's dead. <laughs> and then you, oh, Macy. <laughs> she just touched the, are you okay, baby? Are you okay, baby? Come here, come here, are you okay? That's hot. It's crazy, dog. All right, guys, <laughs> on to the next one. All right, guys, for number eight, we're going to be finding new shows to watch or things to watch on YouTube. Right, guys, for this one, we're going to be finding new TV shows or animes or whatever you like to watch. Um, some recommendations that I have that you guys should go watch. Um, like uh, On My Block Season 3, all the seasons are really good. Um, and anime-wise, I've watched Junie Tyson. Uh, it's Zodiac War, and then, uh, like, a good YouTube channel that you guys should check out. I mean, obviously my channel, but, um, like, I love Danny Duncan. Danny Duncan, he makes great videos. Moly, any of, like, the VR kind of people. Um, also, all the sports channels, 
they have um they've released almost every game that's ever been played and uh it's just really great right now but uh you guys go find some videos and comment some down or, i mean like videos or movies comment some down in the description and if i've watched it i'll like your comment uh thanks guys on to the next one all right guys for number nine we're going to be taking care of our personal hygiene and uh just taking showers brushing our teeth doing stuff like that all right guys for this one i'm going to be teaching you guys how to shower so you're going to get your uh, water nice and kind of warm you know i'm doing it fully clothed because you know gang gang and then you're going to just you know the shower fully clothed and then, and then once you, once you're, oh, gotta get my towel just in case, you know, just in case it gets on my phone. But so, then you're gonna get some soap, little bar of soap, and you're just gonna, you're gonna rub that in, you know, all over, get it all over. <laughs> what am I doing with my life, guys? And then. You're gonna, uh, you know, uh, I don't really know. You're gonna get some uh, some shampoo, right? And you're just gonna put it all over. What am I doing with my life, guys? And you're just gonna make sure to rub that in. Rub it all in. Get your shirt nice and clean too, you know? <laughs> all right, guys, on to the next one. Number 10. Make a pool inside your house so that you can swim. All right guys, for this one, I'm gonna be showing you how to make your own pool at home. You're gonna sit down in your bathtub, you know, and then you're gonna get some goggles. You're gonna, you're gonna put those goggles on. Here, I'm gonna let you got your goggles on, guys. Then you're gonna sit back. I got, oh, I got a Charlie horse, guys. Oh. Uh, and then you're just gonna slide down. Oh. And then you're gonna learn how to swim, which is kind of hard. Cause it's not a lot of room. Not a lot of room to do this. But you're gonna learn how to swim. And I'm not going to teach you. I'm not going to teach you how to swim. But I just taught you guys how to make a pool at your house. It's like, go swim. Learn how to swim. Alright, guys. Um, Alright, guys. Thanks for watching. Um, it was really fun to make this video. But uh, here's the outro.